What's up, ladies and gentlemen? This is Sal. You are watching the Back Cap here on Sal TV. This is a series that has been made through uh, TF2 logs and the heavy use of editing. So you're just going to see the highlights from a match. Today, the match is between the Golden Gents and Agua Ruim. And of course, the guy who made this video is none other than the lucky Naked Ape. He's a pretty awesome dude. He's helping out with making a new series. So let me know what you guys think, what can be improved. Right now we are, of course, watching the Wills Cam. He's going to start taking people out left and right, knocking out the heavy, going for the demo man. Of course, the spy, not going to get away with that stab either. So Wills here defending the point very effectively. Of course, then we're going to move on to a spy. And by the way, you're going to see a lot of spies today. We got a nice little backstab there on the scout. Well, uh, walk, watching the scout walk around the corner, just like, okay, well, I'll take a free stab. But is he done yet? Looks like he's spotted the enemy team, the medic, the heavy, everyone. And there goes the med right away, Lakeside. So good for that. And my voice is also gone, by the way. But, uh, yeah, S9 looking like a pretty good spy so far. Going to lay down the sappers. And there is just nothing that our red team can do right now. So, looks like Agua Ruim loses the round, maybe? I don't know. Chuck Wagon, of course, we're going to watch the other team spy now. As he's watching his team capture the point. He does decloak behind that bed. I thought he would have seen him, but uh, turns out, no, not quite that attentive. Chuck Wagon starting to lay down the sappers, and a nice shot to finish off the demo man. And we're not done watching the spy. No, no, no. You thought we were done. You thought that was it. Nope. Chuck Wagon's back again. He's going to decloak right back here at the enemy spawn. And uh, he swings once the med. Finally, the swipe takes him down, and Chuck Wagon, he's feeling pretty good about that one. Uh, the spawn camping the med. Very good. Gantito, of course, using the gunslinger engineer. Does get a nice shotgun shot off on his opposing engineer. I think that's very as, I, I believe. And Cantito, he's running around uh, behind enemy lines. Who is he going to spot next? Lays down a mini sentry, and that's going to be very helpful. Nice shotgun blast to the face, and he does take down both a soldier and a pyro just by himself, his engineer. Killer Zebra, of course, on the sniper. And Lakeside is such an awesome sniper map, so Killer Zebra is going to go ahead and, uh, I think it was a body shot, maybe? Body shot. Meanwhile, Red Ev... Uh, or red electron bolt. I don't know. Going for the uh, black box jump, and he spots a sniper up here. Uh, wh what's going on? Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> okay. okay. All right. Take down the sniper. No problem. No problem. Because now, of course, he will spot a med, and there goes the drop. Nice shot by Red Ev. Good positioning on that roaming soldier. Uh, Wills once again, though. This guy's gonna be on a rampage, taking a rocket to the face. It doesn't even matter, and it might take a pillar two here as well. Yeah, he will take a ton of damage before. Finally going down. If he goes down, maybe he won't do that. He'll just sit there at the dispenser and uh, kind of hang out. Things are looking pretty good for him. S9 spotting the med once again, and we've got more stabs. Chuck Wagon, maybe almost around the same time. I don't know. Uh, actually, it's the start of a new round, so you know what? It's probably not. But Chuck Wagon, you go ahead and decloak. How do he even get there so fast? Who knows? Pretty good rollout, but Chuck Wagon, go for the med stabs, and these meds are just crazy bad at staying alive. Of course, probably, probably most of the team's fault, and that's by checking. But Biscuit comes in for another med kill as well. These are so important. Critical med picks. I haven't seen any air shots yet, though. But Chuck Wagon, guys, you know what's going to happen when you see that name on your screen. He's going to throw some crazy stabs. Heavy trying to put him on his camera and uh, managed to completely turn the wrong direction. So that's one of those one of those stabs that Stabby Stabby talks about. Nice little shot there. Not a headshot, but it'll finish off the soldier. Now we do see overtime. It's our favorite time here on South TV, overtime. And a nice little stab, but I don't know if it's going to be enough here as the blue team is doing a very fantastic job of hanging on to the point. Uh, you know, red's coming in, doing some decent damage. Actually, they might just get this and keep it in overtime for a little while. They've got to hold it for a minute 20. I don't know if they do. Uh, and in fact, looks like we're going to see it go to 3 to 2. I think that's going to be in favor of our blue team. But I actually don't remember. So uh, I apologize. Naked Ape, of course, we're going to we're gonna have to get him a better scoreboard. Son of a gun, though. A nice headshot on the demo man and AR dude. Uh oh, this is what happens. You let a demo man get in on top of you for free. Tons of damage coming down. He takes down Hobo Freddy. Here comes a Crits Creek. He's not even done yet. Gonna do some crazy damage there to Marsifilio. I don't even know. Uh, that's gonna be pretty good damage, though, by Dude from Agua Ruim. It's now 3 to 3, and some nasty, nasty demo man play coming out save that round. So, uh, this, of course, went into overtime. We've got a Chris Creek going on, but that Chris Creek may not do a heck of a lot. Non-believe. Oh, no, I'm sorry, Brycey, who apparently does not believe in his own team, just believes in himself. Going to get up here and do some damage to his opponents. Going to capture the point by himself, or at least hold it off from the red team. And now he's got to eat his little, uh, little robo sandwich there. Once again, we've got Cantito with the crazy, crazy engineer on camp. Taking down a med. 
Going for the demo man. It's going to be too easy for that engineer. So final score, Agua Ruim 4, Golden Gents 3. Thank you very much for watching. That was a pretty decent match. We'll try and get you some uh, some more matches coming up pretty soon here on The Back Gap. And uh, let me know if you think this is a worthwhile thing to do, of course. We want to hear your opinions here on Sal TV. I appreciate it, and I appreciate your viewership. Naked Ape, thanks once again for making the video. And all of you out there who play competitive TF2 in any fashion, thank you for playing.